Are you tired of your office chair because it's not comfortable and it doesn't provide support like a headrest? And there's also not enough cushions so you can't sit on it for a long time. So if you're trying to get rid of your old and comfortable chair and looking for a new one with really good quality, please stay tuned. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and for today's video, we are gonna do another unboxing and this time we are gonna be unboxing an ergonomic office chair which I think is perfect for working from home and for also a gaming chair. So this is my first time ordering from Autonomous and they are known for their ergonomic and office products just like a standing desk, ergonomic chairs and other office products. So we are going to test that out if you are interested and if you are looking for an office chair because you bought a really cheap office chair which sucks and which is completely uncomfortable and gives you more pain than comfort then keep watching and without further ado let's get started with today's video okay so i ordered a chair from autonomous and it's called the logic fox ergonomic office chair saddle shaped mesh seat and it's really not that expensive it's only 246 with free shipping and it comes in two colors black and white so it comes with different features that we're gonna review later on but this is the product that I have. I'll put it in the description box below too. And there are also a lot of different chairs that you can choose from that are also ergonomic and really budget friendly. So Autonomous will deliver the chair in one box. So these are the parts I lay them on the floor so it kind of looks overwhelming when you unbox them because there's a lot of pieces but it looks like it's kind of not gonna be too bad to install this hopefully and they did provide a manual here for assembly and they have broken down the instructions to different parts like first is the base assembly Next is seat assembly. So there are steps here. Next is the chair assembly and the armrest assembly. So, so far we have four steps. So, hopefully, that will not take long. And they did provide us some tools in here the screws and Allen key. Okay. All right. So, let's get started. Okay, so I'm also going to time myself to be more precise so we all know how long it will take to assemble this chair. So I'm going to get started right now. Okay, so first is the base. So we have to assemble the wheel onto each hole. Okay, so the base is going to be this one. And this, these are the wheels. Uh, so the base upside down, push the wheel into the hole, push the wheel into the hole with a fair amount of force. Okay, after the wheels were 
installed, turn over the base and insert the gas lift. This is the gas lift, the cylinder. Okay. Into the center hole of the base. Okay, so they did label the different screws in here. So this one says armrest bolt, so you would know which screw to use. And we are gonna use some of the washers here. The washer, spring washer, and like three kinds of washers. Okay, so I made a mistake. So we have to actually thread an M6 flat washer with a screw in here and just to make your life easier grab a proper like screwdriver for the allen tool because it'll take you so much longer and it's just a pain to use the tool that they provided Okay, so that took me a while. <laughs> this is the, probably the hardest part, but okay, so the trick in here is to screw in, place the middle one first, so you can make sure that it's stable, and just make sure that, that these two are aligned, because if you do this first, these two will be easier to screw. Okay, so I hope that I got this right in place because this was labeled as the right armrest but it doesn't say in this seat which one is the, the left or the right. So hopefully I got it right. Mm. Okay, so I got two armrests installed now and there is a second part to step two which is to install the mechanism bolt in the middle of the seat so that's what we're gonna do okay i think i suck at installing stuff so i got it the opposite way i got the wrong holes so i had it like this earlier where the lever is on this side but it should be on the other side like this so it could uh, yeah fit in the correct holes for the screw okay Okay, so we are now moving on to step three, which is the chair assembly and I guess we have to match the holes in here and that that's where we are gonna screw it i think you need another person to help you like lift this or like hold it in place so you can like screw properly but i'm gonna try to do this by myself Finally, we are at the last step in assembling this chair. So it's all coming together now. And the last step is to install the headrest. So this is pretty simple. You just need the bolt, the correct headrest bolt. It's labeled in here and just cover it. So let's get it started. So I think we're done. We had every part assembled in here and I'm just gonna check the time. All right, so stop. And it took me 46 minutes to assemble all of this. So it just took me less than an hour to install and assemble this. It took me longer because I made a lot of mistakes and the instructions were not very, very clear for someone probably like me. Maybe I just suck at uh, reading instructions or assembling stuff, but it's manageable. And maybe you just needed help to hold, you know, 
the chair together when you're screwing but you can do this by yourself so less than an hour is not bad it doesn't take hours for this to assemble even if you make mistakes Living life every day, late at night, not okay All I want and I pray all I need are some better days Fuck me, I'm looking in the mirror So foggy, but I've never seen clearer I don't really think anyone can save me And honestly, I'm not really sure I want saving I like to be my own worst enemy There's no risk if you don't try at anything So I'ma just get by in everything See you in the next life, have to be a better me I don't think that my head's on straight Gotta... Alright, so let us now start the review Of the features of this Autonomous Ergonomic Office Chair Okay, so let's get started with the headrest. So this headrest is adjustable If you want different heights if you want it lower or higher like this you just like move it like that If you want it higher just lift it. So it's really easy to adjust it Of course one thing that I love about this chair is that it is made with mesh material which is really breathable i love that kind of chair compared to the leather gaming chair so you also you got lumbar support here to support your posture for comfort the armrest also is adjustable you can like push it forward okay so you can also like push it forward like that if you want it more in front or like backwards like that and of course we can adjust the height of course of the chair we have the lever in here to make it higher and lower and of course you got wheels if you want to move it around okay so that is the basic features of this ergonomic chair which is also budget friendly and it seems like it is made with good quality materials Okay, so that's it for today's unboxing video. I hope that you enjoyed watching this and if you have any comments or recommendations for any products, please leave a comment down below and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching.